This is 2K Sports. All right, so we are going to jump into the next game. We play Chicago. Might try to do this one a little differently since it's not like I'm playing a lot anyway. I might just try to commentate throughout the whole game, but we'll see what's going on. So, But we got to see if we can contain Rajon Rondo and Dwayne Wade. So let's see what we can do. So we got a nice game here going at home. Last game was away. Feels good to be back at the TD Garden, whatever Boston's arena is called. Actually, I don't really know. I'm not a huge, huge Boston fan, but... So we are back. Of course, I start the game on the bench as per usual. Drebko's big face right in mind as per usual. There's Jimmy Butler, amazing defensive player. Horford going up against the jump against Lopez. So Boston gets the ball first. We're going to go ahead and skip ahead. Here we go. Two minutes left in the first quarter. Let's see what kind of damage we can do. I am on, well, I was on Grant, but now it's changed. Man, the cursor changes too much on this game. But all right, that's cool. We gave up a three with me as soon as I came in the game. I don't think that was my guy, but me and Isaiah on the court at the same time. That is a very interesting matchup. Uh, Jimmy Butler is guarding me, so we're going to see how that's going to go. See if I can get around here and get open. I am struggling. Jimmy Butler is all over me. That ball, Olenek. And I was open down the paint. Isaiah's got it. See if we... Had to get it off. Isaiah got it to me late, and I get the friendly roll. Got the shooter's roll. Very nice touch. We will take it. I had to shoot that one under pressure, but uh, whatever works, works. So now let's see if we can contain some Jimmy Butler. That's going to be tough. I like Jimmy Butler. So here we go, Felicio with the ball, He's looking for a post up down with Laverne. Nice shot, don't get it though, there we go. Jalen Brown got it, Isaiah Thomas coming down the court, I'm open on the wing, but they did not decide to get the ball to me, which is perfectly fine. Jalen Brown with a nasty rebound going in over top of all those guys. Very, very bright future for that guy, I do believe. So here we go, coming down court. Isaiah is on Grant. I'm still on Butler. Al Horford there. Let's see what we can do. They're kind of just stalling with the ball, moving it around a little bit. That was going to be a terrible shot. There's a shot. I'm trying to get a rebound, but I'm not getting one. Oh, man, what a block. Let's see if I can get a steal. I can't get anything going defensively, but we're just a minute or two into my session here. So there we go. A shot. I'm probably not going to get the rebound. No, I out-rebounded Jimmy Butler. That is a positive. So let's dribble the ball down the court. We're going to try to set a pick and roll. See if we can get Olenek to do something nasty here. Olenek, he is going to miss because why would he not? He had that one great game in the playoffs against, uh, who was it, against Cleveland? Or against, uh, I'm sorry, not against Cleveland, against uh, Washington. But man, he has not really done anything since, of course, in the series. And then on this game, he has not done anything. So Grant looks like he is trying to dribble the ball out. I am on Butler. What in the world? That, all right, apparently I decided to punch Jimmy Butler in the face. Not really sure why that happened, but it is all right. Let's see if it was a good foul. No idea. No, okay, Jimmy Butler made it. I hate the camera angles on this game sometimes, but that's all right. Jimmy Butler taking the free throw, makes both of them, so definitely not a good foul. We're just going to heave this one from half court, full court really. Into the first quarter, 14-12. We are down by two, not looking too good. We were up when I came in the, came in the game, and uh, now we are down, so uh, not looking good on me. All right, we are starting the second quarter. Let's see what happens. Put me in with a minute 30 left. So they're running me and Isaiah on the floor at the same time pretty regularly, which seems very interesting to me because we were both uh, both points. Al Horford taking the crazy three, and it gets the nice shooter's roll, so that is good. All right, I am on Dwayne Wade. This will be my toughest assignment yet. Let's see if we can pickpocket Dwayne. doesn't look like it. Garden Wade for a rookie like myself is probably not a good thing. Jimmy Butler is just eating people alive in the paint. So Isaiah bringing it down. See if we can set a pick for him, get him open a little bit. He decides not to use the pick, and that's fine. Let's see if Horford wants to use it. Yeah, nice screen. All right, well, well a little weird, but we'll take it, man. We're taking the points. Like I said, I said in the game before, it's not about me scoring points. I want my team to do well. Man, I want to get a steal on Wade. That's what I want. He is struggling. There we go. Let's come down court. Challenging Wade and one. 
Let's go to the free throw line. Let's try to get a three-point play here. We challenged Dwayne Wade, and we won on that one. So let's all right. Let's shoot the free throw. Ah oh, man, first free throw miss of the season for me. Uh, wish I would have made that, but I let go of it a little early. Jalen Brown with a nice steal. Here we go. We're just actually gonna stop, pull up, pop, drain. Oh, just like that, three pointer. And that's seven points, man. Just like that, I am getting hot. That front office wouldn't hesitate to make a big move. This is an organization. So Jimmy Butler looks like he is going to try to end the quarter. It looks like he's just holding for a last second shot. Come on, challenge him, Jalen Brown. Oh, here's Butler. He's coming off a 34 point game against Brooklyn. And I thought the contribution he made by just generating contact. What a shot. All right. Well, there it is. That is halftime. We are up 39 to 24. I'm coming alive. The rest of the team is doing well, and that's what we like to see. Here we go. One at 48 left in the third. I have finally decided to make my presence. We are up big on Chicago right now. 50, uh, 39 to 56. Olenek is open, and he has no idea what he's doing with the ball. He is just dribbling it away. Passes to Young. I'm going to pull this. I'm feeling good. And, sh oh, man, right off the front rim. Olenek finally makes a bucket, so that's some good news. Thought I got the shooter's roll there. Trying to get that 10. On average, that 10 points a game at least, especially for the rookie season. I think it'd be great momentum going forward. So Olenek drains the free throw, too. Three-point play puts us up by 20. Hopefully, with us being up this far, hopefully they'll play me a little bit in the second half. Let's see if we can get a steal. Man, I almost got it. All right. Poke the ball loose. I'm doing that every day. I got good hands. My defense is pretty solid, which is weird because I'm a sharpshooter. But, uh, you know, whatever. That's the way it works. They're getting ready to inbound the ball. We need a big defensive play. I'd like to get it down the court. Score, I'd like to go up a little bit more. I'd like to maintain this lead. You don't want to take your foot off the gas. You want to continue pushing on it. They set the pick. Screened by Grant. That's a two from Butler. He just looks uncomfortable offensively. Really. All right, here we go down the court. Jalen Brown gets it up to Kelly Olynyk. I, for some reason, decide to run out of bounds. Apparently, I'm a little drunk. I must be a little intoxicated coming into the game for some reason because I don't understand why he would just run like that. But it's all good. We're trying to make up for it right here. I'm sure we'll change. As long as we don't get a stupid foul called on us. Well, what are you doing, dude? He's got to be drunk. He is all over the place. No. Man, I, okay. I don't know what my deal is. We got to go down and we got to get this three points back. So let's see if we can get something off of a screen. I am not hitting it today. That's all right, though. All right. We have got to... We have got to start playing better. Crowder made that shot, which made it pretty solid. So let's see if we can get a steal here. Get a steal. Let's go down court. Let's push it up. Oh, and one. Okay. What an interesting play. Apparently, I've hurt my neck on the play, but it's all good. Very, very nice play. Challenging. I like going to the hole like that. So let's see if we can drain this free throw. We struggled last time. That one should be good. Right there. Ten points. That's my season average, so we're doing way better this time down. In that regard. And it is clear that Prez plays with a lot of fire. Poke the ball loose again. I'm going down because I want to get this bucket right here. Let's jam that black boy right there. We are going to celebrate, pointing at people, calling them out. I'm having a game for the ages. So highly touted coming into the lead. Outside Butler, the dish to Grant. There's the pick. Huh, nasty pick. See if we can get a board. Nope, time ran out beforehand, but 67 to 42. Man, we put the foot on the gas, and we are not letting up. So hopefully I'll get to play a little bit in the fourth quarter with the commanding lead because I am a bench player, but we will see. Nope, didn't get to play hardly any in the fourth. But, hey, tis the way that the NBA season goes. So minute 16 left. Let's see if we can uh, – I'd like to get another basket, maybe one more basket. That would be pretty nice. In it on 14. 14 or 15 points, I think that'd be nice. So we need to get a steal. There's another steal. Should count as a steal for me. I don't know if it did or not. Okay, thought I was going to go in. It's all good, though. Hey, apparently I'm feeling it right now. Nice little kiss off the glass there. 
you get on my dude here, get on Dwayne Wade. But, uh, yeah, I was actually trying to go in for a layup, and he didn't want to do that for whatever reason. win will give them four on the season. And as we get set to put this one to bed, a one-sided season series thus far. They've won Dwayne Wade for three. Good box out for me. We're going to cut over, see if we can get the ball in the corner over here. I am I was open, but I'm not anymore. For him, from a leadership standpoint, he set the tone for the entire team with the way he moved the basketball. Always see if we can get open right here, right here, right here, right here. That should be good. Nope. All right. My three-pointer is struggling, but when I go into the paint against these monsters, it seems that I'm doing pretty good. So that's pretty weird. Give me a rebound here. Let's drop down. Okay. Let's. Oh, not go backcourt. Here's Prez. That's off. That's in. All right, I can't figure it out. That should have not been good, but it was. 16 points. I don't know if that's a career high or not, but, uh, yeah, that's uh, lead the game in fast break points, too. Got a nice accolade there. 16 points, two rebounds, three steals. Heck of a game. B-plus teammate grade. I wish it was a little higher, but I didn't get any assists, so I understand that. All right, Prez. Time to talk shoes. As a top draft pick with a great nickname, the sky is the limit. Now these companies believe in you and what you can be in the league. So picture this. Nike wants to bring you on the team right away with a cash deal. We're talking regular check and bonuses based on your performance. So they're gonna put you in a Nike team shoe to start. But if you continue to dominate like I know you will, we're talking signature shoe. Nike's gonna look real good on you. Right next door is brand Jordan, Team MJ. Sounds pretty good, right? They want to start you out with a cash deal and put you in in a team-themed shoe. And if you continue to rise, if your star gets higher, they want to graduate you from a custom colorway all the way to your customized signature shoe and all the perks that go with it. But what they really want is for you to be the face of the brand. You and the power and prestige of Jordan, the GOAT himself riding side by side off into the sunset. I mean... Come on, Jordan, are you kidding me? They look awesome. Check this out. Under Armour is counting on you joining them. They want to start you off with a cash deal with a lot of room for bonuses. And they also want to set you up with your very own custom colorway. They're going to make you like the face of the brand. I think this is the perfect opportunity to segue us into your own signature shoe. I mean, Under Armour came to play. Did we come to play? I came to play. I know you came to play. And last, but certainly not least, Adidas. And they want to run with the presidential theme. I mean, they're talking billboards, cash deal, and they want to make you a custom colorway, Adidas shoe, featuring the colors of the American flag. And get this. They want a custom billboard with the presidential theme. And we're talking commercials, ads, signature shoes. I mean, I think Adidas is the place to go if we want to run with the presidential theme. I'm in. Are you? So it's up to you. I mean, I know it's a lot to think about, but you're in a pretty good position right here. Look, I don't know, Bruce. I feel like this is harder than picking a college, you know? Like, way harder. I, I need a, a spreadsheet to remember all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. But, you know, personally, you can't lose, right? You're in a win-win situation. So it's wherever you feel the most comfortable. And not just on your feet, but as a business partner. So take your time, kick back, relax, think about it, and I just need an answer in about five minutes. All right, what shoe company are we interested in pursuing? Uh, I like the Adidas stuff. I love all that stuff. I love the idea of all the brands and stuff. Um, it's tough not to sign with Jordan, though. Uh, what should we do here? You know what? I'm going to sign with Adidas. Nice. Good choice. This is the beginning of big things. Adidas is going to be so pumped about that choice. I hope so, man. I'm telling you, I'm excited to get it started. <laughs> Gotta love it. My Adidas and me. It's like I used to break dance in those things when I was a kid. All 
Alright, so my thought process is I want to go with Adidas because I could go with Jordans. However, I'm not in this game to become another Michael Jordan. I want to be the first me, and I'm taking the route that I know I need to do, which is sign with Adidas. So let's check the text here real quick. Thinking of getting some people together next week at 4 p.m. Would you be able to make it uh, next week? I guess it depends on what day. 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Yeah, I can do 4 p.m. Let's do that. Tell Carmelo... Music to Melo's ears. Fantastic. He's weird. He always types the 7 there. Let's see what old Denver wants here. We've been playing WWE 2K17. I have. Uh-oh. I installed it today. I guess uh, let's play sometime. You in? I am in. I installed it today. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's some Metal Gear Solid for PS1 type stuff. Uh, my mom, big blow, I win. Uh, let's see. I know you've been in games like that before, but did it feel different in the NBA? I'm going to say not really because I am confident in my ability. And I know that I can outplay anybody on the court. I feel like a proud mama seeing you snatch three steals. Thank you. And that's going to be it. So we are going to end the video there. That's it. Um, still getting kind of used to doing the commentary on this. I feel much more comfortable doing it on the NBA Playgrounds. But we are going to get used to this and we are going to keep doing these. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we will pick up in the next episode when we go to Cleveland and face LeBron James and Kyrie Irving.